From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. All right, everyone, I am Mark J. Weather on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok tonight. We're cooling down. It's going to be a chilly start to our day, 7 a.m. temps. Lower and middle 30s, even a few upper 20s sprinkled in. Patchy clouds, a little bit of fog. Quiet weather tomorrow, a little morning fog inland. Some isolated rain showers for the afternoon. Warm coat weather, 40s, that's chilly. I think Thursday we're up to 62. Isolated rain late, late. Most of the day you're dry. Get out and walk the dog Friday. A morning shower, 49, and then 40s through your weekend. Rob? Mark, uh, here's a look at today's top stories. We've learned new information about the three Ohioans who tested positive for coronavirus. University Hospitals confirms all three were sent to the ER at UH Cleveland after being seen by their primary physicians. Infectious disease personnel protected head to toe examined them in pressurized rooms to keep the virus from escaping. Six UH caregivers in close contact with those patients are now in home isolation. The test results on them are pending. Governor Mike DeWine just shared his recommendations for trying to stop the spread of coronavirus. One of them, no spectators at indoor sporting events. He wants just the athletes and the people essential to the competition there. The governor also recommends the college students returning from spring break in a foreign country be screened and that universities now switch to remote learning instead of in-person classes. Ohio-based Fifth Third Bank is accused of opening fake accounts for customers to meet sales goals. A lawsuit filed by the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau claims Fifth Third workers even funded some of those fake accounts by moving money from a customer's existing account to the new one without their consent. This allegedly happened since at least uh, 2008 through 2016. Fifth Third called the lawsuit unnecessary, saying it already investigated these allegations. For the latest news and weather, go to News5Cleveland.com or open the News5 app. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.